Hello, welcome to the March 2015 video edition of the Iowa General Fund Monthly Revenue Memo. I'm Jeff Robinson, Senior Fiscal Analyst for the Iowa Legislative Services Agency, the nonpartisan support agency of the Iowa Legislature. Net general fund revenue experienced a slight decrease of 0.3% in March. Payments made with individual income tax returns were down for the month, and this was expected as March is the month farm income tax returns are due and farm income is expected to be down for tax year 2014. In addition, quarterly withdrawals of sales tax revenue were quite a bit higher than last year. The withdrawals generally relate to local option hotel motel tax receipts and sales tax arrangements that utilize tax increment financing. On the positive side, corporate tax deposits were higher and tax refunds were lower than last March. Turning to the fiscal year to date, net revenue for the year has increased $214 million, which equates to 4.7% increase. Year-to-date adjustments are minimal, so the 4.7% figure is a good indicator of cash fiscal year-to-date growth. This chart provides general fund growth on a cash year basis by major net revenue category. The time frame for the chart is July 1 through March 31. On the right side, you see that overall net growth is $215 million. Income tax withholding contributed $146 million to revenue growth, and sales and use tax revenue accounts for $88 million. With the filing of farm income tax returns in March, this category of estimate payments and payments with tax returns is down $25 million and corporate tax deposits have decreased $13 million for the year. The Revenue Estimating Conference met on March 19th to review and re-estimate general fund revenue for fiscal year 15 and 16. The March Revenue Estimating Conference projects fiscal year 15 net revenue, including transfer revenue, will equal $6,767,000,000, an increase of 4.3% compared to actual 2014 revenue. For fiscal year 16, the projection is now $7,176,000,000, an increase of 6% compared to the revised 15 estimate. While both estimates are lower than the December REC estimate, the new estimates incorporate negative law change adjustments enacted by the legislature since the December estimate was established. With adjustment for the intervening law changes, the estimate increased revenue projections $9 million for fiscal year 15 and decreased 2016 revenue $38 million. In summary, net revenue growth in March decreased slightly. With the transfer revenue items excluded, year-to-date revenue growth is 4.7% through March, and that is a bit below the 5.5% REC estimate made in March for the same revenue items. With the exception of farm income, tax returns filed so far this tax season are showing growth across all sources of income. So there is a good chance that once the income tax returns are processed, the results will be quite positive for fiscal year net general fund revenue. Goodbye, thank you, and please check out the next monthly video memo in early May.